Hello, hello. This is a video for B2B lead generation. I haven't done one of these in a while, so I'm going to do it right now. And this is going to be a free version. Um, you can do everything for free. So if you are starting or if you just want to see how you can generate leads, this is generally going to help you. We're not going to talk about SEO here, pay-per-click options, because those are all paid. You can do some of those things yourself. Uh, setting up ads and st but you still have to have a budget this is going to be a video completely free outreach that you can do if you're starting out if you're a new business or even if you want to hire somebody like myself my agency to do a, a lead generation for you i'm going to explain how to do that like subscribe stick around let's begin lead generation is as it says generating leads for your business making money b2b lead generation is not hard a lot of people are afraid and thinking, you know, I have to um, go out there, be online, and what am I going to do? Uh, how do I generate leads? If I open a small business, what's going to happen, etc. It's not hard to generate leads. It's not hard at all. A lot of people are afraid because they're new into this or they never done it. But simply said, uh, most of my businesses are referrals because I don't have time to go out there and get new businesses. But if you don't have referrals, if you're not at the point where people are calling you, finding your channels or doing something i'm going to give you great ways to generate leads for free and fast as well so there's going to be a few things that you can do yourself first thing that i want to talk about is having a website blog website whatever you want to call it have it just one page it can be a free one as well just have something where you explain what you do what you can offer etc so just have something very simple and easy i haven't updated my website in a while i did the website myself i like doing things myself even though i have a developer uh, a team i have uh, uh, people building um, uh, everything pretty much from a to z so uh, i like doing things myself because then i know and i do suggest you do a lot of these things yourself even if you're a business owner you, even if you're making money just to get the glimpse of what it is like so you understand when you're hiring somebody what you're paying them for so the first step is having a website second uh, step for you for you is to have either a linkedin profile i highly suggest having a linkedin profile or maybe uh, Facebook profile or maybe Instagram profile depending on what you're offering for B and B2B best uh, uh, profile to have is either um, LinkedIn or Alignable and I'll explain both because both are amazing so uh, uh, LinkedIn is great because you can have your profile and people can search for you and find you online and you can do the same thing yourself you can find people online um, and uh, you're gonna have your profile on there and uh, and when people search for a specific, uh, uh, for a private lender or something, I've, I've been in real estate industry for a long time. So um, uh, this is my profile for my, where I work full time. So if they find me online and they give me a call, I know this came from LinkedIn, but I can do something better with LinkedIn. I can uh, join a lot of groups, post on there, spread the word. And that's okay, but it's not really going to bring much. But the best thing about LinkedIn profile is you can do the outreach and you can directly message people. What happens then if you message to any of the, if you send a message to any of these people, uh, you're going to end up sending them a message and they're going to receive an email on top of the, the message that you're sending. So um, that's a double marketing effort for free. So the way to do it. The way to automate all of this, you're not going to send uh, 100 messages per day or per week. Right now, there is, um, there is a limit on uh, how many messages per week you can send. But 100 messages to a targeted audience is perfect. So let's say we want to look for a freight forwarder or something like that. I used to be in freight forwarding business. So let's say logistics and I do a lot of marketing for them. So um, freight forward in California. So you can select people in the, in the freight forwarding word, world and then... Uh, you can do next, uh, you can actually, let me just turn off my phone, excuse me. Uh, yeah, so you can find these people and then you can say, okay, so I want everybody in the United States because I, uh, I do marketing for US only or worldwide or whatever you do. And then all these people, uh, you can connect with them. Or you want to say CEO, you can do, use LinkedIn, like it's a, it's a, it's a search engine. That's how you should think about it and use it. So... Add all these people, if they're all in freight forwarding, you want to do marketing for them, you want to do something for them, or they're your targeted clients, you're selling something to them. And you can connect with all of them. I strongly suggest you first connect with all of them and whoever accepts your connection, sending them a message. 
Uh, this would be really boring because you would have you would have to go page by page, hundred pages, sometimes more, sometimes less. Less, I don't know. You would have to go through ton of pages, click connect, etc. Manual work is really not worth it. Um, the way I do it, it's very simple. I just go and get myself something that's called LinkedIn Helper, and it helps you generate leads automatically. It's free for fourteen days. There is no affiliate. I'm not with them. I don't. I know the owner, I spoke with him a few times, but I do not have any connections with him. I'm not getting anything uh, from this video. You're getting 14 days trial, and for those 14 days, you can reach out to a lot of people, uh, uh, and you can generate some leads. So what it does, basically, it's it's a high, I would say it's a, it's a big a learning curve right now. It used to be a little um, uh, extension for Google uh, Chrome, but right now it's a full-blown software, but it's amazing. It's so amazing. You wouldn't believe it. You can add so many people. You can message them. You can select a few step messaging and you can set it all up in one day and it's going to work for you for the next month, two months. And it's cheap. It's not expensive. You can get it for the base version for like 15 bucks a month. That's very cheap. And that's good enough to start with. So even uh, there is a free version for 14 day. It's good enough to start generating uh, generating leads. So um, LinkedIn is a one way to generate leads. Uh, if you're doing something like web design uh, needed, you can always search for things like this, where people are actually. So let's restart. Let's restart everything because we're gonna look at the posts. And uh, you can actually search something like web designer need if you're a web designer or something like that. If you're trying to generate leads from uh, um, um, LinkedIn directly, you can actually look at the posts as well. People are going to post, hey, I need a web designer, I need this, I need that. So you can connect with them, right forward or needed. Whatever you want to do, you can do that as well. Uh, because if people don't have somebody in their network that knows somebody like for web design for telemarketing You can actually go there and find these posts. You can like them comment, you know, ocean fright great You know, you guys are do a great job if you need for example If you connect with this person you don't have to connect with these people you can just comment on their posts and say hey uh, a Great. Uh, I liked your post whatever if they post something better than this of course and be like hey I know you do ocean fright we do air fright Let's connect. Something like that is good as well. So a lot of people see it. So posting on LinkedIn and uh, doing outreach on LinkedIn is an amazing way to uh, to get as many people as possible in your network and actually talk to the decision makers. So LinkedIn is a must uh, tool for any business owner for B2B marketing. Second one is Alignable. This one is amazing as well. This is so good because not because of the connecting with people adding people whatever you can add them you can connect whatever you can accept and then send them messages but the better thing is they have communities and there's a lot of people in them so if you join a community and you just uh, actually uh, it's groups sorry not communities communities are okay they're 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 given but the groups so for example my all things email marketing group when I post a video on here, and I don't really do it much, but if, if I if I do a video like this for YouTube and I post it on here, I'm going to have a lot more views. I'm going to have a lot more likes. People are going to see it. So if it's a good post. And uh, one time I had a post about email marketing, if it's good or not. Not on this group. On general, this is a smaller group, 6,000 people. There's large groups, huge groups. Uh, all thing digital marketing group. I think th this was a group. So I posted him. Do you guys think that you know? No, this is five thousand. So there is a bigger group. But the point was, I posted and said something like, "Hey, do you guys think cold emailing is ethical?" And everybody started arguing and, and things like that. And I had a link to my uh, YouTube video about cold emailing, and I had like a few thousand views just from the from that. You know, when when we discussed if it's legal, if it's ethical, whatever. Uh, uh, and I ended up getting a lot of calls and meetings. So uh, you have to utilize the power of either helping people, talking to people, and you don't have to get on the phone. You can just get in the groups and just be active and just talk to people. A lot of people are going to spam, but uh, uh, once you get to the point when you find a good post and you have a great answer, people are going to see that, they're going to reach out to you. So I suggest being on something like LinkedIn and alignable at least hour per day on each platform and then networking with people, talking to people, etc. So uh, uh, that's the point of finding leads online for free completely free you just have to put in your effort and if you don't have any uh, if you don't have any leads right now if you're just sitting at home looking how to find leads find, you found this video 
you have to create a plan from today until next month to do 200 messages per day every single day you have to do uh, you can do linkedin you can do alignable you can do any type of uh, platform or you can uh, go on uh, facebook groups but out do outreach you can send manual emails and you can do outreach for at least uh, uh three four five hours per day and you're gonna get clients like crazy so it works uh, next thing is Facebook groups. I don't really like them because they're really spammy right now. But let's say something like this logistics. Again, we're going, it doesn't matter what the company, what, what the, the industry is. You can, you can search for any industry, but let's say you work with logistic companies, you find these groups and there is 167 K members. That's huge. That's big. So shipping from China to South Africa, please. They're looking for that. Uh, if you have a client in South Africa, you can just write there. Hey, hey, I can have like these guys are. So you have to be active in those groups. But let's say you sell something to them. What I did in this group, it was really fun. I made a video on my YouTube channel. I put something like free uh, marketing, like I'm doing this video. So I put free marketing for uh, uh, freight forwarding companies. And the only thing I did this it was in this group uh, post something like, uh, "Do you guys need?" Do you guys want to know how to do free marketing for your, if you guys want to know how to do free marketing for your freight forwarding company, drop your email. Within an hour, I had over, I think, 40, 50 emails in that group. And I just replaced my post with a video. I just didn't want to reply to everybody. I scraped those emails, sent them the video manually, one by one in Google. And then I just post the video and they, the admins deleted it because you're not supposed to promote anything. But uh, you can actually ask those type of questions. Say, you guys, if you guys want to find out, drop an email. They were dropping emails like crazy. It was really good. So I had a lot of, a lot of uh, 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 emails. And I, then I sent them my video. And again, we had a lot of views on that video. So the idea is to promote yourself by helping others. If you seem like an expert, if they see you're helping, you can easily get to the business owners and uh, get them on a meeting with you. And I'll go over the meeting. Uh, another one is sending cold emails. Lists can be found online. As I said right now, Facebook groups, you can scrape them for free. I have a video on my channel. You can find it, how to scrape emails for free. There is a soft piece of software out there that you can scrape. And you can scrape those groups. You can scrape uh, websites. You can scrape whatever you want. But to send emails for free, cold emailing, you can do it through Google. You don't have to pay for cold emailing. I, I, I send... Uh, millions of emails each and every single week but you don't have to pay for that if, if you don't have the budget if you do it's easy you just talk to me but if you don't have the budget you can get something like yet another mail merge and it's simple addition it's a simple uh, extension for google sheets where you upload the list and it's going to send 50 uh, emails per day all to inbox it sends from google just don't spam have an unsubscribe option have um, your address legally you have to have that and also um tell people that you're offering don't just spam don't offer crypto don't offer bullshit just offer business services tell them what you're offering be honest tell them how you can help them and they're gonna call you because if you're trying to help people online that's your job to help people and they see value in what you're offering they're gonna call you trust me so um you can send 50 emails per day that's not bad that's already uh uh you know are, that's already half of the job you're just sending emails automatically you can you can create lists 50 50 emails per day you put them in google sheets it's going to automatically send emails and then you keep on do that, doing that every single day it's it's amazing uh if you have g suite um if you have G Suite or any G Google Workspace account, you can actually send 1500 per day for 50 bucks a year. That's cheap. That's really cheap. Or 25 bucks personal, up to 400 users a day. Uh, realistically, though, it's about 300 through Google. So you can send through Google 300 emails per day. That's also amazing. 25 bucks per, per year. That's cheap. But again, if you don't want to pay anything, there is a free option. 50 emails per day, good enough. Another way, if you want to call, if you want to get on the, on the, on the, and, and remember for any, anything that I'm talking about, if you don't want to do it yourself, we can do it for you. Uh, uh, I have cold callers, telemarketers, uh, a virtual assistant who can do the outreach for you. But again, if you're just starting out and you want to do everything free and cheap, you can do that yourself. Another great thing to find those leads, business leads as well, is by typing new business license listings. And I'm going to do a brain, a, a whole video on this, how to find things like this so let's say you wanna you wanna do something like you know virginia beach whatever the, all the government's town halls they usually release these on their websites and these are brand new business leads so uh businesses that, that open like any of them whichever opens first um they're gonna post their phone numbers and you're gonna see 08 
2022. So this is pretty fresh. This is from two, two months ago, I think. Yeah. So that's pretty fresh. This is a these are brand new businesses. They they've been in business for a month or two. You know that this is brand new. So all of these businesses, some of them might be a uh, um, franchise. So you don't want to reach out to them unless you work with them. Uh, but a lot of them are gonna have. Um, and as you can see, phone number 757633, you see the phone numbers on here. You can actually reach out to these people. So you know what they do, Spe uh, special service, retail, retail, uh, retail, whatever, mass therapy, whatever. So you can reach out to these people and be like, so flow cheap. Uh, the number of business, the, the applicant's name, you don't mind, you don't care about that because it's going to be a trade name. That's the business name. So these are all business names on the first left side here. And then the address and then the trade. Uh, city etc so what you want to do is reach out to any like let's say spirit halloween superstar you know halloween is coming up you know it's going to be big they just opened up a month ago they're going to sell a lot of stuff so you can reach out to them and be like hey if you're offering marketing to them you can be like hey you know we do marketing and promote halloween stuff and whatever you can give them a promotion or an offer something that they are going to like and then close them as a as, as your client and right now is the time. So all of these are brand new businesses. You can go a few months back if you want some a little older, older business. But if you're big to be and you're selling something to businesses, this is really a great way to find your businesses and to get them to actually um, um, to, to get them to actually talk to you right there because they're brand new. And, and you can see uh, business name again. I went business license li license listings. You can look that uh, you can find it on Google, and you can put in a specific city if you want to try in your city. Not all the cities and towns have this, but a lot of them do. So let's say Nash Creative Steps. You have their phone number. You gotta reach out to them. You gotta call them and be like, "Hey, I found your phone number." Or you can tell them something like, "Hey, this I know. Uh, uh, welcome to the world of new businesses. Do you have any other business, or is this your first time getting into business venture? Okay, I know it's very tough and hard. We can help you with this, 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 and that." These are our pricing. If you guys need that, let me know. Very simple, straightforward, and you call all these new businesses. So that's that's another good way to to generate leads daily by telemarketing. So we said doing the outreach and messages at least two hundred messages per day. If you don't have a single client and a customer, you have to call uh, at least hundred numbers every single day on top of sending messages. So you do that, you're gonna be. Uh, uh, swamped with new leads and you're going to be working a lot and you're making a lot of money so nobody can uh, uh, say that you know unless they're not doing anything for themselves unless unless you're not doing any outreach you cannot complain that there is no client or the times are bad it's just that you're not doing nothing but you're not doing much about it and the last thing that i want to talk to you about that's completely free, free and it's the strongest one one of the most uh, easiest and strongest way to get clients is if you're an expert in some field, like I'm in email marketing, digital marketing, pay-per-click, SEO, I just don't do all the videos and I don't do a lot of videos, but because I wanna help you guys out with all these free videos, but uh, uh, for my clients that I've been with for, for a long time, I do a lot of things. Uh, but let's say I wanna do side projects like I do and I help businesses grow, I help businesses generate lead. The easiest way to do is just build a YouTube channel and do the videos that people wanna uh, look into so I don't do a lot of videos this is my entire channel that's all for the last what five years ago first time I posted and then 10 months ago whatever so it's it's not frequent it's not good if you have time and you have no clients I would say do a one video per day possible one video per day posted every single day online be persistent and results are going to come so basically five years ago I posted a, a, a video 2.3k views it didn't move much it wasn't optimized i just posted it and then uh 10 months ago i optimized that video a little bit it's a very similar keyword and i had 3k views uh, uh in the last 10 months um, and going forward from there every single uh, every uh few months i do a few videos every every few days and as you can see they all have views they all have 100 plus views and that's 100 plus people that might be your clients or a customer. So if they need an email server, once they see my video and they're like, okay, so this guy knows what he's talking about, I'm going to work with him because he is an expert. Same goes for you. If you're an expert in something and you can explain that and show people how to do that themselves, you can actually 
uh, uh, help them get started. And then once they do, they're going to come back to you anyways. They're not going to want to do email marketing themselves and digital marketing themselves or telemark or whatever else. They, there is so many things online. They're going to come back to you. So having a YouTube channel is very important as well because you can generate free leads as well. And to track all of that, use Google Analytics, use uh, uh, Google Site Kit. That's a really good plugin. And you can see where your traffic is coming from, how many people are coming from which uh, social media. Or uh, uh, if you're writing, you can use something like medium.com and you can post a lot of content. Uh, I do suggest using more videos like this or having... Um, images because people are just getting lazy honestly that's that's the world we're going uh, to they don't want to read much they want to look at a video they want to read something and that's about it so basically if you do want to uh, uh, have a channel i suggest researching the keywords you can just type on google as uh, youtube seo free keyword uh, planner or something like that so you can get the amount of people searching for specific keywords it, it, it really it's not, it's not good to have a keyword that nobody's going to look for because you're just wasting your time so do the little bit of research uh, for example this one how to scrape email that i was talking about for free uh, it's 3.2k people they're looking for it and it's just going to grow from there it's just going to grow the good thing about youtube it always grows so basically even if you have an email uh, a video from five years ago if it's a good content they're going to come back to it so it's it's amazing and uh, having a customized channel um, it's it also helps so have your uh, logo have your phone number someplace on about page have your links and uh, that's how you're gonna get clients you don't even have to have, have many subscribers I'm not active on my YouTube and people still find me and call me I talk to them daily so um, so it's that's the idea 15,000 views good enough for me because I'm not looking for for uh, a lot of new clients or a lot of side projects when I have time I can do them so uh, for me that's perfect if I did not have a single client right now everything that I talked about that's how I would do it myself I would be hustling I would be on the phone I would be on the uh, uh, I would get a dialer probably and I would do anything and everything in my power to get leads that's the backbone of any business that's what feeds your family and yourself so you have to be there and work at least four or five hours per day if you want to do this even if, if it's the side projects and you have a single project put in four or five hours per day every single day do what i just told you right now for a month and you're gonna see it's gonna work if your message is not working within a, a, a week, you're going to know that change your message around. So if you're sending a, a single message or you're doing telemarketing and people are just like, hey, yeah, I'm not interested. Fine. There's so many good scripts online. Look on YouTube. Do the research before you start. Compile a few messages. I would suggest at least 10 messages for social media, for emails, for whatever else you want to send. And then start and see which message performs better. Uh, track people coming to your website see where they are coming from if it's the right targeted audience if you're hitting people that are not interested or not in your target group you're wasting your time and niche down immediately make a small niche for example freight forwarding for me real estate i've been in a lot of industries so real estate freight forwarding mortgage um etc but that's because i've been in this for fi or 15 years if you're just starting out niche down and be like okay so right now i'm freight forwarders are, are my target and i'm just gonna send messages to them i'm gonna work for them so that's the idea let me know if you have any questions write them in down in comment subscribe like i'm gonna uh, pop out more videos and i'm gonna explain how to get pay traffic uh google ads pay facebook ads etc if you have budget you can actually do it easier you don't have to do anything of the manually or you can just hire people to do all of this for you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.